hello. Look, it's Boris. Oh, he's not very happy though, is he? What's up, Boris? Are you sad? Oh, what can I do to cheer him up? I know. I'm going to give him some chocolates. And that always cheers me up. Here, Boris, do you want some chocolate? Their salted caramel flavour. Oh, didn't work. I know. Why don't we go for a walk or go play out in the garden? Come on, you love football. Should we go and play in the garden? We're going to look at the flowers. Oh, do you remember the flowers we saw yesterday? We... Do you remember how nice they smelt? Can you smell it? Oh, that didn't work either. I know. How about this? I'm going to give him £10. That's a lot of money. Come on, Boris. Here, I'll give you £10. Make you feel better. You can buy whatever you want for £10. What do you think? Yeah? He looks a bit happy now. Oh, Boris! Don't, don't blow your nose on it. Oh, I'll have to wash that later. Oh, well, how about if I gave you my card, okay? Will you be happy to spend my card, spend some money? You can buy loads of things with a card. Oh, dear. What can I do? What can I do to make you feel better? I know. This is it. I'm going to give you some love. That's it. I'll give you a big hug. Does that make you feel better? Oh, that's it. It's love. Love what makes us feel better. It's love that keeps us strong. Chocolates might cheer us up for a bit. The beautiful nature might make us feel happy. But it all disappears. And no matter how much money you have, there's always things that can make you unhappy, but love can make you feel strong inside. And that's because we're built for love and out of love. We're built to be loved. God so loved the world that he gave his son, Jesus. And Jesus, it's the sign of the cross, is the sign of love. When we make the sign of the cross... We're giving ourselves a hug from God. We are. We go from my head to my heart, from my shoulder to my shoulder. God loves me. I'm giving myself a hug. Why don't you give yourself a hug from God? Do you remember how to do it? From my head to my heart, from my shoulder to my shoulder, God loves me. Because on the cross, God spoke words of love. Do you remember what Jesus said? Father, into your hands I give my spirit. Father, forgive them, for they do not know what they do. So in the midst of all that pain and suffering, there were words of love from God. Words of love, words of forgiveness. And if the worst thing that happens to a human is that we die, if God's love is greater than death, if Jesus rose again from the dead, then that's why we can always trust in God's love. That nothing separates us from the love of God poured out in Jesus Christ. So that's why it's important to pray when we're sad to receive that love that God wants to give us, to give ourselves that hug from God. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. So I'm going to ask you to pray, if you want to, to pray with me. Just put your hands out to like that. And it's the Holy Spirit that brings God's love into our hearts. So just say, come Holy Spirit. Come into my heart. And fill me with your love. Fill me with your peace. Fill me with your courage. 
fill me with your hope. And we can ask God to look into our hearts and to see what we need and to give us it through the Holy Spirit. Look into my heart, see what I need today and come Holy Spirit, give it to me today, your grace, your gift. Amen. So, if you're ever sad like Boris, just remember, give yourself a hug from God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Okay, so take care and we'll see you soon. God bless. Bye. Say bye, Boris. <laughs>